Here you are. I got your message. I couldn't find a rest yet. What happened? Cece knows the truth about Warren. Oh, no. Oh, no. Lionel, is he going to turn him into the police? No, no. He's uh, blackmailing me into making a deal in order to keep his silence. I can't believe that. I thought you knew the man. Cynthia, do you know what the sentence for armed robbery is in this state? It's 15 years. I don't have a choice. I have to make a deal. Awful. It's just awful. I mean, Cece has more compassion than that. I don't think we're talking about the same man. Ina, listen to me. I don't want you to see him for a while. I'm going to go and talk to him. I don't think it'll do any good. He has me where he wants me. No, I'm going to try. I can use all the help I can get. Thank you. you take advantage of a person like that, huh? I'm just trying to find out who... What is it, Sophia? Well? You know about Warren. Oh. Oh. I see. What are you going to do about it, Cece? Well, I don't care running to you, huh? I should have known. What are your plans about Warren? That depends on Lionel. I think that's despicable. Using a young man's life for some sort of deal? I chose not to turn him in because I felt some sort of pity. And I also felt guilt because I'm partly responsible for his self-destructive kind of thinking. Well, that's your prerogative, Sophia. You feel like taking all the guilt, you can take it. You want to take all the responsibility, you can take that, too. I take none of the latter. Warren made his own bed. He made up that debt himself. I think I'm being very generous what I'm doing, giving them the choice, Lionel and Warren. I don't think anybody else would do that. I don't think the police would do it. I don't think a judge would do it. How can you be so fish? Cold. I thought I knew you. Oh, you you are really being pretty quick with your judgments and your condemnations. I haven't even made up my mind what I'm going to do yet. Whatever it is, Cece, it stinks. How many years and how many lives have you already tried to manipulate? Haven't you learned anything? Lionel's battles. Did he beg you to do that? You volunteer. I came here on my own because I am outraged. And I am ashamed. I am a part of this family, whether you believe it or not. My children live in this house. And your whole life revolves around this feud with Lionel. But that does not give you the right to drag anyone's children into this. This is not Warren's feud any more than it is Kelly's or Ted. It's your battle with Lionel. Don't you see how unfair you're being? Unfair. Interesting words coming from an unfaithful wife. I've hurt you. Oh. Hurt you. And I can see what it's done to you. It's hardened you. Cece, I know that somewhere inside of you there are such good feelings. Can't you see what this is going to do to our children? If you continue to try to get after Lionel using his son, it's going to call for more revenge. He's going to come after you, and he is going to get you where it really matters with our children just like you're doing to him. You won't have anything left to hurt anybody with. Not when I get through with him, because he's a beaten man, Sophia. And I'm going to tell you something else. If he's smart, he'll take that devil of a mother, he'll get out of town, he'll do it for good. And that is my dream, my... Obsession? No. You mean obsession? A lifelong, sick, all-consuming obsession has poisoned you, and everyone has come in contact with you. What was that way? I wasn't, Sophia. Not until I found out about you and I. There's much to learn, but this is anything else. You can hide behind that as long as you want, but the truth is I am seeing a cold, a ruthless man who doesn't have an ounce of human compassion left in him. 
And you can take yourself and your unwanted opinions to get out of this house. I don't want you anymore. Get out! Get out now! Damn it. I have already left this house a long time ago, and you might want to think whose fault it really is.